What's up guys, welcome to my new YouTube channel, Abby's Designs. Today we're going to be making a beer bottle opener. So the beer bottle opener is going to be made out of these oak scraps that I had sitting around from some previous projects. Uh, this is going to be a gift for a wedding that we're headed to this summer. Alright, so now that we have all our pieces cut out, we're going to um, start attaching them all together and just do some assembly. So, um, you can see how this is going to go together. This is going to stand up like that. Um, this is the front piece that we cut. We've got our two sides and then the bottom that'll form, uh, you know, the little bucket that'll catch the beer caps after they get popped up at the top. Um, so, this is how it goes together. We're going to be adding that uh, bottle top removal device. Um, up at the top there, that'll be kind of the last thing we do. So um, we're going to first start with adding these two sides onto this base piece. Um, and I'm using exterior nails. That's not necessary. Um, I have a bunch left over from a previous project. Um, if the customer chooses to use this outdoors and it gets wet, um, I guess since this is a beer bottle opener, um, there might be some, some uh, liquids spilling around. So. Um, I guess we won't have to worry about that regardless, but um, first thing I'm going to do is mark out uh, my location for all the screws and uh, I'm going to do that where all the screws go. So I'm going to put pretty much probably two screws in each piece and I'm just going to measure out um, and mark where I want each of those screws and then I'll be able to drill pilot holes and uh, put that together. So let's go ahead and get started. And that's one side ready to go. Continue doing this until I get the, the other side on there along with the bottom. Then we'll talk about the front in a second. All right, so we got the two sides and the bottom on. Now all we have to do is attach this face. So um, it's gonna be more of the same here. This is a little bit easier though because we're you know, we don't have to balance it at all. Um, so I'm gonna line this up and really worrying about the top and the sides more than the bottom because the bottom's not gonna be seen. You know, people will be looking at it from the top so you wanna make sure your joints up top are pretty flush. Alright guys, so this piece is all sanded and uh, it's ready to start wood burning. Um, so the last name of the couple who are getting married is going to be an S. So um, I, I actually printed out a, a nice S that I liked online and uh, I traced that onto right where I want it. Um, here's the bottle opener mechanism that is going to be up here so I left enough room underneath it um, for this S and I'm going to use my wood burning tool right here it's heating up right now um, to burn this S in and then I'm also going to try to put a decorative kind of half circle around the outside of it um, so let's get started burning the S All right guys, finally got the wood burning done. Put the S there and I decided to go with this little uh, circle with the, some leaf pattern. I think it looks pretty good. Um, so the last steps are gonna be to put stain on it along with some clear coats and then attaching this at the top. Um, so uh, next step's gonna be staining. Uh, so we'll get started on that. Alright guys, got the beer bottle opener mechanism attached and now this bad boy is done. 
Um, I think it looks sweet. We put some stain on it, put some clear on it. Um, the S looks really nice with the little decoration. Um, I think it looks awesome. Um, guys, this has been a really fun project. This is really simple. It's cutting pieces to length, screwing them together. You can make this look as decorative as you'd like. Um, and we really think that the newlyweds are going to love it also. Um, guys, I had a lot of fun building it. Um, let me know what you think about this project in the comment section below. And thank you for watching. Um, last thing to do is to test it. So let's do that real quick. Hope you can see this. The goal is to keep the bottle cap in the bucket. Let's see if it works. Hey, that is sweet. Unfortunately, it is... Uh, oh. I got some uh, overflow going on here. Unfortunately, it's early in the morning right now, so this is gonna be a casualty beer. We're gonna have to uh, pour this down the sink, but good news is it works, and uh, it's gonna catch a lot of beer bottles in the future, I'm sure. So thanks for watching, guys. Let me know what you think in the comment section, and uh, have a great day. All right, guys, beer bottle mechanism, opener mechanism.